Hi besties! Welcome back to my channel. I am so happy to have you all here today for another Timu haul. Some steals and deals. And uh, so yeah, we're just going to get kind of right into it. Um, first off though, I want to show you guys this friend mail that I got from my friend Laura over at Favorites with Laura. I was so excited to get this Oops, I showed my address this package in the mail yesterday. So if you don't follow Favorites with Laura, please go check out her channel. I will link it down below in the comment section, so check down there. But she went to Hawaii for vacation, and she sent me this really cool postcard. So I was just so excited to get a postcard from her. I love it. It's it's absolutely gorgeous. I could frame this. I absolutely love it. Um, I was just so, so, uh, you know, blown away that she thought of me. I mean, all of us girls would kind of, you know, talk to each other, but I mean, to think of me while you're on vacation and like send me a little gift that's that was just so sweet so she picked up a few trinkets while she was on vacation and she sent me this really sweet little card and i don't want to read it because we're like friends and you know i have to keep some things to myself <laughs> but um so she sent me this really cute little card with it and then she sent some trinkets that she got over in hawaii and so let's see what's in here. I didn't open it because I wanted to open it on camera because I just thought it was just so sweet that she thought of me. I love that. I mean, how thoughtful. I mean, Laura is just such a kind, sweet person uh, anyway. I mean, if you don't follow her, please follow her because she is just, she does some really nice hauls. So she sent me this, um, it's a keychain and it's, you know, the Hawaii hand. What does this mean? High five or not high five? Oh my gosh. Hang 10 or, you know, or whatever. I don't even know. You guys, I'm talking out my butt because I have never been to Hawaii. I would love to, but it, so on both sides, it's got, I love this. That's, that's so pretty. And then she sent this nail file, like Emery board. And this thing is glittery. Yes, ma'am. So let me get it out of here. And it says Hawaii on it too. It's so pretty. Look at this thing. That is so pretty. I love that. Oh my gosh, it's so pretty. It looks like a surfboard. It's like in the shape of a surfboard. That's pretty cool. And then I have this, oops, something fell out of here. There's this little package that she sent and it's the bubble wrap is hearts, which is stinking adorable. And this looks like a pin maybe. Let me, or, oh, if it is a pin, it's like magnetic. I've never, oh, there's like two things here. How cool is this? Is this a, I know I'm not showing you. There's this little, it's like got a magnet on it. Oh yeah. Okay. Okay. Cool. Okay. That's like a little magnet, I think. And then there's this pin, which I love the pin. That is super cool as well. And then there's this little package and it's a bracelet. So on her last video, I love this. It is so stinking cute. Look at that. Oh my gosh. I love that. Thank you so much, Laura. That was so sweet of you to think of me while you were on vacation. I mean, so thoughtful of her. So sweet. So yeah, I think this is like a little magnet you can put like anywhere. I love that. And the little pin. So I just wanted to give a shout out to Laura because she is just so kind and sweet and generous and thoughtful of other people. And, you know, you guys would love her channel. So please go check her out if you haven't yet. Um, so I just want to share that with you. I'm going to clean my glasses off so I can see what I'm doing. Um, I got these off of, <laughs> I almost said Amazon, not Amazon, off of Timu. And I love these to clean my glasses with. I always keep some down here at work or whatever. And these glasses are also from Timu, and my scissors are also from Timu, and my cloud cutter's from Timu, and this necklace is from Timu, and these nails are from Timu. i am got, got like some fall vibes going. Today was the first day that uh, Dunkin' Donuts had their pumpkin spice stuff, and their pumpkin muffins, and pumpkin donuts, and all that, so I live for this time of year. It's like, it's when I come alive, so... All right, the first thing I want to show you guys is this set of candles. Now, this was a local warehouse item, which I don't buy too many local warehouse items, but I had to have these. Um, I'm sure they need batteries, which aren't probably going to be in here, but this is what they look like. 
Now, these are real wax LED candles. They have a simulated black wick. They, they flicker. There's two, four, six, eight hour timers. They have a remote control, all of the wonderful things. And they were $17.27. So yeah, they came local warehouse. Um, I didn't think that was a bad price for these. I mean, I've seen candles like this go for so much more than that. So let me get them out of the container here if I can. I thought they were really pretty. Um, they have like a, uh, it's almost like a honey, like a not hobnail or honeycomb. I don't want to say honeycomb because it's not really honeycomb. It's more like a hobnail effect to them. I don't think they're solar. They're not solar, but these would be so pretty at Christmas and everything or Halloween or Thanksgiving, like on your centerpiece of your table for Thanksgiving. But you get three pieces. I think these are gorgeous. I'm trying to figure out where to use these like right away, to be quite honest with you. But yeah, you need batteries for these. Um, they take two AA batteries, um, but aren't they beautiful? They're like, there's like a hobnail type of effect to them. And then there's the wick and it'll shimmer and flicker and all of that. And then you get like a small, a medium, and a large. These are great. I hope I don't lose a nail. Um, I literally just put these nails on and I was headed down the steps and one flew off. I'm like, really? Already? I didn't even have them on 15 minutes. So I don't know. And I even used my Candy Moyo glue. And this one feels a little iffy too right now. I don't know. I feel like if you use the Candy Moyo glue from Dollar Tree that you need to buy it. Like, I tend to hoard mine. So I don't know how old this Candy Moyo glue was, if you know what I'm saying. Anywho, back to this set of candles. How pretty are they to get all together? There's like a small, a medium, and a large candle. I love these. I love them. Yeah, very pretty. And they're real wax. Now, they don't have any type of smell to them, but you get, you know, the remote. I love these. I love them. For 17 bucks. I feel like that's a steal, you know? But yeah, put them out in your Halloween decor. I just love the... Uh, I think I like them because I like that they're different. They're not just like a white candle. It's like, you know, it's actually got some like texture to it. So yeah, I love those. I thought that's a great buy for 17 bucks. I will definitely put those out somewhere. I will, um, when I take them upstairs, I'll put batteries in them. So look for a short later tonight and I will show you what they look like. Okay, so keep watch for that. Um, I'll go upstairs, put batteries in them, put them out on my uh, mantle and so you can see what they look like. But I, I think they're well worth 17 bucks. Next is a pair of shoes. I think I bought these before and I've kind of made up my mind that there's probably like 20 pairs of shoes in here because I've made up my mind I'm not buying any more shoes on Timo or clothes for that matter. But these were these were only 488. 488 for these. Um, so it's just a red, they're very light, very, very lightweight. It's coming off a little bit orange, it looks like, on my screen, but it's definitely a true red sandal. They need a, they need worked out a little bit, but they're, they feel very comfortable, like when I put my hand in here, you know what I mean? So, But they're very true red, so hopefully the color is coming across. Like when I look in my viewfinder, they look orange, but they're, they're not orange, they're red. Um, so yeah, I thought they were sort of really cute, and they're very light. They have a little bit of a, you know... Some texture going on back here, but, you know, I don't know how long these would last. I mean, they're very kind of plasticky feeling, but, I mean, for five bucks, who cares? I'll wear them around the house or whatever. Or, I mean, by that, I mean, like, if I go out on the deck, I'll wear them on the deck or something like that. Not like, not like around the house into my living room. I'm not that bougie. Okay, here's another pair of shoes. I, and again, I'm not buying any more shoes from Gmail. <laughs> Like, I just, I'm just not. So, these were $9.99. And I think that I saw somebody else get these as well. I think it was Aaron. Hey, everybody. I'm not sure. I'm not sure, you guys. But it they were $9.99. And they're really cute, too. I really like these. Look like this. They've got, you know, some detail. Um... They seem better made than the last pair, which they're twice the price, so they should, you know. But, yeah, they got, like, you know, even, like, a toe pad right here. So, yeah, I don't know. I didn't wear a lot of sandals this year, so I may save these for, like, next summer or maybe for next spring. Because um, guess what? We are getting into fall season. Yes. 
Oh, it's my it's it's the best most wonderful time of the year for me. I absolutely love fall. Okay, next is this. It looks like a, maybe a bracelet and earring set. This was a dollar sixty one. Let me get it out here so I can. Oh, it's coat. It's three pieces, and I think I maybe bought this before or showed you something similar before. But it's got like the Van Cleef and Arpel. I'm sorry, this is tangled up. All right, I got it on unraveled on um, whatever anyway so it looks like this really pretty necklace really like it again with the van cleef and arpel uh clovers i guess you could call them which i'm obsessed with i don't know why they just they just seem bougie to me <laughs> I, know. I know that's weird okay and then it comes with a little bracelet that kind of has the it just has the same clovers on it like that and then you get a pair of earrings and of course they are bent so I'm gonna have to bend these back into the correct shape but you get a little pair of the earrings as well so a dollar 61 for all three pieces now these are not heavy weight or heavy duty at all um so you know if you're gonna keep them for any well, honestly that's a really big bracelet too that could probably be an anklet so if you're gonna keep a set like this for any amount of time you're probably going to not want to get it wet or anything like that because it's probably going to turn green pretty quick maybe but a dollar 61 for three pieces i didn't think that was too bad so all right i'm not i'm going to tell you right now i'm not very happy with this <laughs> Um, it was 231. Thankfully, it was only 231 because I'm just having. I, I opened this up and I can't really get it to work properly. So, it's like a tissue cover, like something you would keep, you know, your your facial tissues in or something like that. But the problem is I can't get this thing to stay together. Like it doesn't want to fit together. Like I've tried a million times and I'm like. Cause I like to open, that's why I like to open this stuff up and price it because then I can say to you, yeah, I messed with this for an hour and I couldn't get it to friggin' work. So, you know, it's almost like it just, I don't know. It, I literally cannot get it to stay together. Now, maybe if I, mm, there, maybe, oh, 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 I almost got it. See, it's like, it wants to like pop open. So it's just a, too much of a, it's two dollars and thirty one cents of a pain in the butt that I'm just not gonna deal with to be quite honest with you. And then they sent this little bow that you're supposed to like I don't know glue on or something. I have no dang idea. Either way, do not buy this. Yeah, it's just like I push it together. See, and it just doesn't want to stay. Now, you you don't want to glue it because it, then you can't refill your Kleenex. So. I don't know, maybe if I tape it for a while, it'll go into place, but I, I mean, honestly, for $2.31, I kind of just want to throw it in the garbage because I'm already, I'm already irritated by it, so yeah, there's that. Okay, so I bought this before. These, this was $3.29, and I don't, there should be a tape, maybe I'll get to it. There should be a piece of, uh, like a piece of, um sticky like 3m tape that goes on this i have this um attached to the side of my desk um up in my makeup room and then i put like all my brushes in here or eyeliners mascaras or whatever and then they're like kind of oh there they are there's the tabs right there one well, they only give you two i thought there was three but it could the other one could be in the bag so you get these and then they're just like sticky tabs you take the tape off and stick this on the corner of your desk so yeah i have one of these already i really like it um it's useful it's handy it's i i like i mean for three dollars and 29 cents i just like to have like all my brushes in one place but then they're not like taking up space on your desk they're like off to the side you know so yeah i really like that i think i think it's a good a good item it's it's plastic i mean you know so there's that but it is what it is i guess okay a box this was only a dollar 64 whatever's in here and it says transparent so it makes me think it's something plasticky so we shall see what i paid a dollar 64 for that always gets me when it's like a good team move price and you're like oh a dollar 64 heck yeah oh wait i don't know what this is let me look here Oh, I know what I was going to use this for. Okay, so this is like a, uh, I'll tell you what I'm going to use this for. 
Now, you could use this for several different things, for sure, because it's just like an organizational type of thing. So it sits like this. And then you could put like, let's say you have a lot of Copic pens or those Copic markers or whatever, right? Or pencils or I don't know what this bottom, maybe it goes this way. No, it definitely goes this way. Sorry. I had a blonde moment. Definitely goes this direction, but I'm not sure what I would put in this bottom part. But what I bought this for was, so we always get those like drink mixes from Dollar Tree or anywhere, you know, the, the little packets of iced tea or Kool-Aid or whatnot. And I wanted to put them in here because I have them just like sitting in a mug on the counter. So I thought, oh yeah, I'm going to get something to organize those. So yeah, I thought I would get these and then just put my drink mixes in here. You could do them with even like coffees, like stick coffees, because I sometimes will buy those coffees that are like a pouch like a single serving so that's what I bought it for but you could use it for many different other things um, pencils pens markers eyeliners lipsticks all kinds of things but I'm gonna be using it for my drink mixes because we we use a lot of drink mixes here um, so yeah so this is a set of nails it looks like one kind of fell off but I would swear to you that these nails are the same ones they put on those um, boards that are handmade um and then they sell them as handmade and this is a set of what one two three four five six seven eight nine ten fifteen nails times fifteen so that's thirty nails yes I can add so there's thirty nails on here for two ninety nine and look at these I mean they look just as good as the handmade nails and they feel they feel like them too. Like I'm telling you, this is the handmade nails. Now I think that maybe what they've done is buy these nails like this and then spray them with, you know, the, um, fair nail polish or something somehow. But yeah, I'm like, heck, I'm going to get 30 nails for $2.99. So I don't know. I, the color is called per powder purple aurora aurora or i have a hard time saying that word but how pretty are they they're really really pretty um so yeah i don't know i just thought those look an awful lot like the handmade nails that i buy for 8.99 and now here they are i can get 30 of them for three bucks but yeah they come with some nail tabs and stuff but yeah they don't package them very well they literally package them like this so i don't know but anyway We'll try them. Okay, so this is probably a set of headbands for $1.69, which, again, I think is a good deal if they're nice, if they're decent. I'm guessing. So you get, I got three colors here, gray, dark gray, and a black. So let's open up, actually, let's open up the gray one so it's, it'll be easier for you to see it. So you get three for $1.69. Um, and this is, they're very, 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 uh, what do I want to say? Basic. Like, Nothing fancy about this. This is the back. There's, you know, nothing fancy about that at all. Um, they're stretchy. Definitely a dollar sixty nine worth. I mean, these are not gonna last you forever. You get a three pack. I don't know. I mean, they're okay, but they're not. They're not wonderful. I guess. I don't know. But anyways, I got three of them for $1.69, so I need to quit complaining. All right, then I got a set of hair clips for $2.44 or $2.49. I can't read my writing. So there's three clips in here, and these are kind of like giving fall vibes. You know, you get, oh, I'm sorry, there's four in here. So you get four clips, and there's this like mocha kind of chocolate chocolatey brown color and then you get the black one and I love these because they're matte there's like this mustard color one and they feel really like silky and then there's like this tan one so yeah I really like those so you get four pieces for $2.49 it looks like $2.49 so I'm gonna say $2.49 pretty sure that's what my writing says all right next is this item $2.23 it's a little spatula I love having spatulas and I never have enough spatulas around so I bought this one and it's got a wood handle on it and it's kind of like a shorty like this thing's like really short <laughs> that's what it looks like it's like this green kind of sage color and it's got this 
wooden handle to it. So two twenty three for this. It's silicone. Um, it looks like it's made really well. So, but you better not have a really big burger to flip because that's all the bigger. It's like, you know, here's my hand. So it's like the size of maybe a palm of a hand. Better not be trying to flip a smash burger. It ain't gonna happen. So yeah, two twenty three for that. And then I got this little notebook. So it was two twenty three. Which I didn't think was a bad price for this little notebook. Um, it's like a craft notebook or craft color notebook. And then you get a pen with it. So you get this pen that's like got the craft color around it. And then on the inside you get some little sticky note tabs. And then it's just, you know, lined paper. And it says memo, date, place, number, subject. I'm a note taker. I, I always probably will be. I don't know if it's my age or what, but even at work, I feel like I'm doing this, guys. I feel like I'm leaning back. But anyway, um, when I'm at work, I like to take notes. Uh, I don't know why. I just, I'm a note taker. So yeah, two twenty three dollars for that. I always am buying notebooks. Okay, here's an, almost to the end, guys. So this is going to be a short one. So here's a pair, another pair of sandals or flip-flops. Now... I paid $3.59 for these. Uh, I'm just, I just, out of all the pairs of like sandals and shoes and everything, I'm just not super impressed with the shoes from Timu. Um, again, these aren't horrible. Uh, they say fashion on them. Fashion. And then flip-flops, like you don't know what it is. Flip-flop sport. Ooh. So you look sporty. Heck yeah. Fashion flip-flops. I don't know. That's so weird when they put like words on things. They're just so weird. Anywho, so they're just white. They've got like gold writing and these will probably again be walking out under the deck in the morning and drinking my cup of coffee kind of flip-flops for $3.59. I don't know if that's worth it or not, but you know, whatever. Okay, so then I got this set of nails, uh, another press-on set of nails. These were $3.29, and these are like a black kind of holographic cat eye Ooh, type of look, and you get the nail, what are these called? Nail tab, glue tabs. Um, I hope you guys can see these, but they're like a black cat eye holographic. You can kind of see them, I guess. Um, of course, my ring light's in the way, but... Yeah, so those are really pretty, really like kind of giving Halloween fall vibes there. So we love that. No, no, I don't really, I don't, I don't really um, celebrate Halloween. I celebrate autumn <laughs> and fall, but I'm not a big Halloween person. Um, I'm just not, I never really have been. Um, so yeah, but I thought these were really cute. So yeah, 329 for those. And then, okay, two more items. And that's it. It looks like they're both pairs of glasses. Okay, me and my Timu glasses, right? So these were three fourteen. Uh, it says black triangle. Oh, I can't read that. I cannot cannot even read. It says like black triangle vision. I don't know. Are these supposed to be something special? I have no idea. Okay, let's take these off. <sighs> Taking glasses off is like taking a bra off. You're like, <sighs> okay. So they look like this. They they they're really pretty because they've got like this like um gold thing right there, gold decor, whatever you want to call it. I don't know. And then I don't know what I got these in a two point five oh maybe. Oh, they're really nice. I like these. They fit really well, and like I feel like they fit my face. They're not like as big as I usually get. And I don't know if there's something special with these or not. They're probably blue light blockers, I would guess. Because I can tell by the way they look. You know what I mean? Like, I'm... Yeah, I got them in 2.50. But I just thought maybe they were, like, progressive lenses or whatever they call those. But they're not. They're not progressive. What is that called? Like, bifocal type of things or whatever? I don't know. Anyway, I buy so many readers off of Timu. But, yeah, they got this, like, pretty gold accent right there. And then they come in this really nice case. So... Yeah, I like those. They're really nice. And this looks like a pair of glasses, too. So we're going to end this on a pair of glasses. Okay, these were $3.29, and I can't even see what I'm reading. So let's see what I got here. $3.29 for these. They're like a, almost like a gold champagne 
kind of color. Um, I can't, I literally can't see, you guys. I think they're in a 2.50, but I cannot, I can't tell. So this is what they look like. They're like a gold kind of translucent gold champagne color. Um, so that's what they look like on. Oh yeah, I can see now. And I got them in a 2.75 in these. So I kind of go between like, I, I feel like the 2.50s aren't good for me anymore. I could, so I'm like working my way up, you know, we're getting older, so we're working our way up. But yeah, I kind of like these. They're, they kind of give me like a fall kind of look too, kind of yellow, but like in a champagne gold kind of way. I really like them. Yeah, I like those. Like I said, I get several, oh, they call them amber. Sorry, I just read the box. So they call this color amber. But I buy several readers off of Timu. In fact, most of them come from there. I do need to go get my eyes checked. So I think I'm going to do that soon. Just so I can get like a new prescription. Because it's been like about a year. So I'm due. Okay, everybody. That was everything in today's haul. Um, so yeah, please don't forget to check out Favorites with Laura. I'm going to link her down below. I will also put all the links to all these items down in the comments. I'll pin a comment with the link to my cart. So you can... Go, go there and get, get anything if you're interested in any of these items. And um, thank you so much. Please also check to make sure you're subscribed because I went to someone's channel who I watch all the time and I was unsubscribed and I'm like, what the heck? And I don't know why, I don't know why YouTube does that. So just make sure you're subscribed. Give me a like and I will see you in the next one. Bye.